Hey everybody, how's it going? Simmix has uploaded some full rig captures onto Tone Hunt. They're completely free and they sound like this. So quickly, Synmix has been making Kemper profiles, Quad Cortex profiles, and Tonex profiles, and a few other things for quite a while, and he's gained a reputation as one of the best. My friend had a Kemper for a while, and the Synmix stuff was always his favorite. I mean, there's loads of great things out there for Kemper and Tonex and Quad Cortex, but the Synmix stuff is just that extra step up. And now he's uploaded some stuff for Neural Amp Modeler, and, um, I've got to say, guys, it's next level. So what is a full rig capture on Neural Amp Modeler? It is the whole chain. Pedals or no pedals, amp, cabinet, speaker, under the microphone. It is pretty much everything you need. So instead of just capturing the amp, you've captured the whole chain start to finish. So one of the drawbacks is straight away is uh, you can't change the cabinet IR. It is fixed. Everything is fixed with a rig capture. So it is pretty much a plug and play kind of sound. What I've got going on here is uh, I've downloaded, not all, but I've got most of Simmix's full rig captures on Neural Amp Modeler. There's a bunch here. I've, I'm currently on the Pi Vi 5150 Mark II. It's one of the best sounding all round ones. <laughs> So I'll quickly show you the chain I've got. I'm using the effects of silencer just as a gate. NA808 is a boost, it's a fairly modest boost. And then into the full rig. And this particular rig, I think it is boosted, but I preferred it with the Tube Screamer plugin before it for some reason, it just sounded cool. Here's it sort of raw out the box. So it is a fairly tight tone, but I preferred it boosted. So I'll just take down the input a little bit before I boost it because it does get a bit too gained out. All of these profiles, if you boost them, are a little bit too gained out. So I suggest just putting your input volume down a little bit. About there seems to work pretty well. Just show you the noise floor of it. That's its raw noise floor. I think that's pretty modest for, you know, how raging this sound is. So I'll just go through some of the captures he's done. The Sin Custom Amp. I have no idea what this is, but it sounds pretty cool. A big bold tone there. 
The Engel Savage 120 KT88. Now I use this for both rhythm guitars on that demo tune and uh, this is my favorite rig. It just sounds gnarly as hell. <laughs> This particular amp was captured through a Mesa oversized cab with vintage 30s in it with an SM57. And uh, yeah, it's just got that throaty, throaty tone. It's sort of the best of both worlds. It's one of the best German amps paired with one of the best American cabs. And uh, I love the tone. <laughs> It's got that like kind of roar to it, that growly roar. Let's just keep going. Soldano SLO 100. Apparently this is like a custom Soldano. It's not an actual Soldano. Sounds great. <laughs> And Soldano's, just that sound really lends itself to playing lead. Remember, I am boosting all these patches. I think they sound better boosted. Put some chorus on and some delay. Fifty-one, fifty-three, red. You know, it's the EVH version of the amps again. <laughs> Just an outstanding tone for free, and you know, it's baked in, it sounds fantastic. <laughs> Next is the best amp sim. There's no details on this uh, on the site. Uh, it's just, he's called it the best amp sim in the world. So, you know. It definitely sounds cool and unique, but uh, I don't think it's the best, but I did like it for lead guitar. <laughs> And I did use it on the demo for the lead guitar parts. It just cut through the mix really well. It's got that nice vocal mid-range to it. And we've got a Rev F Mesa Jewel Rack 1992. <laughs> Let's let you hear it roar. And as you can hear, guys, it's kind of flubby. I mean, I like to boost amps like this, so I'm just boosting it. And we're back to the 5150 Mark II. I think this is the best all rounder. So that's about it, guys. Grab these from the site, they're completely free. It's a direct download from Tone Hunt. And I've linked the Synmix website where you can pick up some Kemper profiles and Tonex and Quad Cortex stuff as well if you want. I think that stuff is primo. But if you've got a neural amp modeler, grab these rigs, guys. They're fantastic. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. And subscribe if you want to see more metal related stuff. I'll be back sometime with a video on something else. So until then, ciao.